Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting for me to episode 15 of season 2 of The Ancient Magnus Rides. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Hey! <laughs> Good. That's nice. <laughs> That's probably no one calls me while I'm recording. I have my phone on Do Not Disturb, so if anybody calls me, <laughs> I ain't gonna fucking hear it. My watch ain't gonna go off, nothing. But still. I mean, regardless, you're always studying. Well, unfortunately, you can't do that. You're stuck inside. You're being quarantined. What is that? Okay. Interesting. Yeah. I mean, you have nothing else to do.
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> it should be okay. It, but it's cute that you're being overprotective. <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> so adorable. Excuse me. I mean, did you ever really even ask she saying if she likes music? How are you gonna just assume? Look, look at her. That's <laughs> baby for ya. <laughs> it does make me wonder as well. Because it still films. Uh, uh, I cannot speak. It still feels like two seasons in, and we really just know a lot about she say, but. Not as much as her in her past, you know. We know that, you know, she was sold and such, but... You tried, though? Make for effort. protagonist power. Oh. This bitch. Oh, and then Phil in the background. Hmm. Okay. Pause. Fucking pause. Can we just talk about how the music even stopped? Sad that we don't even get to see what they look like, like her eyes and everything. We know she's blonde and that her dad, you know, white haired, but damn.
I mean, not really, but... Mm -hmm. So, yeah! <laughs> I'm sorry, my mom. Jesus. But she's a baby! Let her play! She had PTSD! It's not the fact that she let you win. He hard had it. Majorly. <laughs> See, now everybody coming down with shit. That's not good. I get that, but in the moment, you don't know what happened. She was struggling because she had a bad memory about her gamma. PTSD! Exactly. Do not be an ass and really think about her. Put... Put yourself in her shoes and think about everything she's been through. I didn't think I I didn't think we were gonna get that. Whoa! Hold everything. Oh my god.
No, you're not. No, but in a way you're so silly. <laughs> huh? Oh, that's the wolf girl. Scared. They're not gonna look the same, are they? We about to traumatize the hell out of me right now. So, wake up, asshole. Nice. It's really common. I hope so. <laughs> mm hmm. Oh, interesting. Silver. Baby is just by herself. Oh my god. Oh no. Yeah.
Yeah, cause see, something about that ain't right to me. No, uh, don't open that door. More? Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold everything. It was already interesting enough that Violet's sister is sick. Now all the rest of them is getting sick. What the fuck going on? This was an interesting episode. Didn't I like the fact that Phil's grandma beat the crap out of the freaking wolf? Like, damn, what, what the fuck wrong with you, bitch? Girl, sit your ass to the side. Like, but that, because she is so all powerful and such, and, you know, their name and such, and she has power over her because she has the babies and everything. Yeah, but still, that's fucked up. Um, Phil hesitating. Phil having PSD in this episode and, you know, her cousin lashing out on her. Did not like that. I mean, you know, and, and I love him. Don't get me wrong. He's a very interesting character. Love the hell out of him. But he still barely knows much about her and the situations that she dealt with when he wasn't around. And so even in the moment when she say ran after her and, you know, said, hey, you okay? Is she crying? Da, da, da. And Phil turns around and she sees her cry. And all she could immediately think about was herself in really depression moments and very shocking moments. Like, I, I was not expecting to, number one, see that. And then, two, especially going into detail, like, Chise, baby Chise is standing in front of a mirror and she has almost, like, lash marks on her back like that is already hard enough to see and anything else bad that's happening to her and once again this is as i clearly stated in the episode it's like you know we know so much about our current she say but we just don't know what she was like beforehand and such now i mean we can go back to i think when i was watching season one and i even said i was like oh yeah there's like four over here episodes should i watch that and everybody was like no you ain't gonna worry about that don't worry about that and i'm like okay cool and you know we kind of got the same thing with this where i was like yeah there's gonna be an episode do i need to watch it no no no, no. like it's good but it's not really necessary uh, okay okay should i still watch those you know let's get that answer real quick but um seriously would love to see something more on her past especially how she was growing up you can see that she say already had a very hard tragic life up until, you know, she met Elios and, you know, her world was changed for the better and she is able to be a smiling person. Because when we first met Chise and seeing how sad she looked all the time, how quiet she was, the dead look in her eyes, especially when she looked at Phil and she was like, I recognize that look and such. It's just, once again, it just shows you how much she's grown as a person and as an individual and stuff. And I honestly cannot wait to see what else is in store for her. But still, you really just want to know a lot. <laughs> Maybe one day I'll read the series. Not today, though. <laughs> one day. <laughs> but yeah, this is a really interesting episode. I, I don't like what I, I like some things that happened in this episode. Don't like everything that happened. But yeah, now that everybody's getting sick, and we are almost into well, we are in the cold and flu season. I need to get my flu shot like very quickly, um, because I'm trying not to get fucking sick like I did last year. That was not a pretty thing. That was the worst thing of my, the worst like three or four days of my life. I won't get sick. I don't think y'all want to get sick either. Go get your flu shot. Mm -hmm. Moral of the story. Go get your flu shot. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode 15 of season 2 of The Ancient Magnus Bride. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos for you like. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for episode 16. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.